Good morning, YouTube. Hey guys, today is the day I've been waiting for since October. You guys know um, I, I got a sponsor back at the Crappie Invitational, uh, Crappie Expo, uh, Shut Up and Fish, came on board as a sponsor. And we've been waiting for this lithium battery and I'll explain why in a minute. So today, guys, we are gonna be installing two lithium batteries for my trolley motor. Uh, man, I'm excited. I cannot wait for you to see the features of these things. Awesome batteries, big thank you to Shuff and Fish. Y'all check them out if you would. And uh, man, y'all stay tuned. We're gonna get this thing installed. All right, guys, so as I said, this is gonna be the fun part, the unboxing, which I've already opened them up to look, to see what I needed, but here we go. Look at that, I'm picking it up by plastic. You cannot beat that. They do have handles. So they're called Gill Batteries, G-Y-L-L, -L, and uh, almost like my name. Um, so we got two of these things. make it a 24 volt all right so these will go in place of my other batteries just I'm gonna basically put them right next to each other strap them down the same way um, these things have such great advantage um, number one there is a an app on there so I can look at it my phone I'll show you all that in a minute but I can well you know what here let's just do it now um, See, I put it right in here. There we go. So I can connect to batteries. I'm going to connect to the 54, which I believe is this one. And right now it shows I'm 53% charged. That's pretty cool. 13.17 voltage. Uh, there's nothing coming out. Current temperature of 20 Celsius. Uh, Celsius. Um, I can look at each cell and tell how they're charging. Awesome. Go to back to the main. So 53% 50, charge. Now, one thing I had to do, I had to go through here and take out my um, my old charging system and put a new one in there. So I went with uh, NOCO, no, no, N-O-C-C-O or N-O-C. I'll tell you in a minute. Went with that one so I did. I could charge lithium batteries. So we put that in uh, the other day. Did not film that because it's pretty whatever. But I'll show you that here in a minute. Then I'll show you what we have to do to... To get this hooked up, the hardest part is going to be pulling these other batteries out. So I'm saving a ton of weight because those other batteries are roughly 50, 60 pounds a piece. I got two of those, say 60 pounds. I got 120 pounds sitting right here. I got a small child sitting right here. These batteries, really, I got one finger. It's, it's a little tough. 22 pounds per battery. So I'm putting in two batteries that, lay, that weigh less than one of these right now. It's going to be a huge time, uh, uh, weight saver, especially before I go to Tennessee. So let's get these things installed, guys, and let's see how it goes. All right, guys, so uh, I'm using two cameras here, but basically what I, this is, so this is what the setup is. This is the, the brand new batteries. The way I have them set in here, my positive, is coming in right here from my motor or trolley motor cable that will go here then I will series using this cable right here I will series this negative to this positive then my negative goes here that will go into that that will give me 24 volts I do have to add the charging cables for each battery um, from this so that will all go in there together and uh, we'll make it happen. Let me show you 
this right here i'm gonna flip the camera around so this is the new actually let me flip it this way this is the new uh charger so it's a 3x charger and basically what i have to do is and i'll go ahead and do them now is well actually i got to get it plugged in first but you see there's a lithium op option in there and it should be that second one 12 volt lithium so i have to flip that over to that option and then i can start charging lithium so i'll leave number one lead acid because that is my starting battery i have not changed that All right, we gonna try my trolling motor. All right, guys, so that is the install of the lithium batteries. Pretty cool. Uh, let me go into charger here. Let's see, connection. I'm gonna go into, uh, doesn't really matter which one. 13.13 uh, 13 volts, zero amperage being used right now. So uh, still, it's on standby, still at 20 degrees Celsius. So pretty dang cool, it's still working. 53% uh, charge. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to move right on over there and hook up to power and I'm going to charge this thing just for a little bit while I'm doing some other stuff and kind of take a look at how it's working. Go ahead and set that and I'll show you how I do how I do that. All right guys, so I got power now. So uh, basically what I'm going to do for these two, I'm going to move this over uh, to lithium. There it goes. I'm on the lithium battery there. Barely see. and the lithium battery there so there there now the battery should be charging so let's check it out yeah i've got this uh yep there we go so i want to say a big thanks to uh shut up and fish for sponsoring us with these batteries um it, definitely go to their website check them out these batteries you know like i said there's a five-year warranty on them um they uh they're waterproof they do have that app on there uh, let me show you that real quick so just started it out at 53 i'm at 56 percent bat uh voltage right now uh 13.36 per battery is what it's showing charging temperature 20 uh, 20 degrees celsius and i can go into here and look at every cell make sure everything is is charging so one of the things it has in there it does divide the the cells so they equally charge uh, so you get a full connection on that um, but these batteries are i, I want to say 550 dollars right now you can get them at um, at uh, shut up and fish and great great um, investment in my opinion um, 22 pounds per battery versus 60 70 for each of those so basically i just put 44 pounds of battery in the back of my boat where that's less than one of my lead acid batteries uh those i mean I, those two batteries equal a small child in here um for some people's boat that probably doesn't make a difference but when you're using fuel when you're trying to get speed trying to get top in um, everything counts so um, anyway great great battery i'm dang excited about it so big shout out to dave over at shut up david uh, goodson at Shut Up and Fish, and that's this is what we were working on back at the uh, at the uh, Crappie Invitational, um, the Expo, back in October. I said I had a new sponsor. That's what it was. We were just waiting for the batteries to come out with the Bluetooth uh, capability on it. So eventually, I'll probably go ahead and throw one more of those in um, and run my live scope off everything else, and then I can just charge it directly there versus having the Amped Outdoors battery, but I'm still using the Amped Outdoors battery now. Uh, works well for me when that thing is gone, then I'll turn around and, and put something else in here, but this is a perfect deal. So, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Hope you've got some information. Hope you check out Shut Up and Fish. They have more than just batteries, guys. They have electronics. Uh, they sell LiveScope. They sell Garmin. They sell Hummingbird. They sell everything. 
So uh, definitely check them out. And uh, it's shut-up-and-fish.com. I'll put a link below, and there's actually in the description is a link to them as well. So definitely go check their website out. I appreciate it, guys. If y'all would, would, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. When we come back, we're going to have some video from Tennessee. Uh, that's where I am now, so I'm putting some of these things out. So anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks so much, and we'll catch you on the next episode.